Alright, welcome back to another uh, shitty tutorial. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to uh, charge one of these 1500 hitters, which uh, has been requested. Uh, so, let's just get right into it. Not to uh, waste time, you're going to need a pair of pliers. Um, easy enough. Um, and a stripped Samsung. Just cut the uh, end off of it. Try to separate the black and uh, red wire. If you want more in-depth, uh, check out the first video and then come back to this one. What you'll need to do first is take the pair of pliers and just squeeze onto the uh, end of it like this. And you'll just want to do that until you hear a simple crack. Um, and and or with the flat or edged bit, it doesn't really matter, but sometimes the edge bit works a little bit better. I am filming on potato. Um, and just uh, do that until you hear a slight crack. I already did it with this one. Just take my word for it that it will come off. Uh, if you have nails, this next bit's going to be a bit easier. All you got to do is just claw this little bit off of it. What you should see is this. I recommend having a sharp tool for the next bit and or using the pliers to get this white bit out. I stress caution when uh, doing this because it can be pretty uh, difficult. I'm going to be using a knife. Um, I'm not going to be able to film it, but just try to dig in and not cut any wires at all. Uh, obviously, or else it's not going to work. Once you get this white bit out, this is probably the most delicate part of the process, which is uh, removing it, um, which just slowly take it out and uh, try not to pull by the wires too much or uh, break them. If you, if you hear a snap or something comes loose really quick, um, you've probably messed up and you will not be able to uh, bring this out properly. Um, there's probably an easier way, but this is just how I'm doing it. As you can see, I was able to slowly uh, remove part of this battery. Uh, what you want to do is just keep slowly wiggling this thing out until you're able to see both ends of it and try to not remove any more than necessary. Another very important distinction, once you get this part of the battery out, which this is all you should need to take out, um, all you need to do is take um, your red wire that you stripped I recommend using a knife or a pair of uh, stripping pliers to clear the uh, metal bit but where the red wire is going in it is red to red and black to black or black to blue do not mess this up do not hurt yourself I cannot stress that enough it is red to red black to black do not screw that bit up okay what you can see here is me holding the red wire for my charger to the red on that and the black to the black slash blue over here. Now, just touch the metal bits with that. <clears throat> and if I did not screw up, you should be able to hold this for four to eight minutes without any issue. And there should not be any problem with that. I'm going to be holding it here for a while, and then I'll be back, and I'm going to put it back together on camera so you guys know that I'm using the same one and that nothing is uh, wrong. You can, guys can take a look um, at what this looks at right now, and I'll be back with you in a few. Now, just in case, if you guys have any questions about this, uh, do, not be feel, do not feel afraid to comment below. Ask, uh, somebody will respond to you, or I will respond to you. Feel free to subscribe and like this video as well. Um, this is not easy or hard to do, but you do have to follow specific instructions and there is a risk that you will break it. So if you have any questions ask, the dumbest question I've received is, does the charger need to be plugged in? Kind of self-explanatory. So uh, let me try to, and pretty much all you need to do is just sh shove this thing back in. Um, I mean, there's really no other way to do it. Um, you may want to, if you pulled it out a little bit too far, there is, uh, a cotton inside. You may have to push in there 
a little bit more so that there's enough uh, of a way for you to make that tension in there so that the smoke will still come out. Just shove it all back in. Um, that's what she said. Alright, I see the light coming on, which means I did not burn out the battery. Um, if the light does come on, you're not in trouble. It's just, it just happens sometimes whenever you're pressing it in. I'm trying to show you guys that now. But, uh, doesn't matter. Uh, what, what do I do now? Obviously, just put this thing back on. It's not that hard. Uh, very easy, actually. Um, um, here's the hoping that this works. That's how you successfully charge one of these. Um, if you guys have any more questions, follow-up videos, and or uh, requests, all you have to do is ask, and I'll be right on it.